everyone, welcome to or back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be drawing a monarch butterfly using colored pencil. The first thing that I'm going to do is grab some paper. I'm going to use gray paper because I think it's going to make the colors pop and enhance the drawing. I'm going to be using a grid technique for this because I want to make sure that my drawing is accurate. The next thing that I'm doing is sketching an outline using pencil. The reason that I'm not using colored pencil for this is because, I mean, I'm sure most of you know, but I don't want to have to go and erase it in the future because it would honestly be a huge pain. The next thing that I'm doing is getting rid of the grid lines. This is an important step so that later on you can't see the grid underneath. I'm also using a needle bowl eraser to lighten the sketch. I think that Mr. Butterfly here had some mixed opinions about whether he wanted to get his beautiful colorful wings or just stay a nice simple sketch because I honestly felt like I did not want to color it in after the sketch because I really liked how it looked. But I mean, you know, it's it's fine. We we appreciate it. We can just let's just move on, you know? Let's just color it in. Let's go. So here you can see I've started adding some colors to the little, I guess, stick that he's sitting on. Um, and then I also added the colors to the wings. I used some really warm yellows and oranges. And I'm kind of layering them so that you really can't see the gray underneath. And so there's a lot of contrast. I'm also adding some shading using darker colors like the darker orange, darker yellows, just to make sure that it's really realistic and it's 3D, which will really add to the drawing. Now I'm just going in with the black colored pencil again and just adding some touch-ups and making sure everything looks right and then erasing the rest of the grid. So that's the final product. I hope you all enjoyed today's video. Make sure to like and subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you all next week. Thanks for watching!